in this video i will introduce you with a new theorem superposition theorem superposition theorem is applicable in a circuit when the circuit contains more than one independent sources in that circuit this is the statement of superposition theorem in a circuit with two or more independent sources two or more independent sources the voltage across or the current through any component is the algebraic sum of the voltages across or the current through that component produced by keeping each source active separately now let me describe this statement using this circuit in this circuit we have an independent current source is and an independent voltage source vs now let's say i am asked to calculate the voltage drop across this r1 which i will denote with vr1 using superposition theorem and i have to calculate the current through this r1 resistor let's say i denote that i1 superposition theorem states that i have to keep the independent sources active separately that means when i will keep this voltage source active i have to turn off this current source now let me show you what the statement is said let's say at first i will keep this voltage source active in that case i will replace this current source with an open circuit that means i i will remove this current source from our network after replacing the current source with an open circuit the voltage that will be produced in this r1 let's say equal to vr1 and the current that will be flowing through this r1 is i1 prime voltage is vr1 prime and current is i1 prime after that i will keep this is this current source active let's say for this is when i will keep this current source active i will turn off this voltage source by replacing it with a short circuit see i have replaced the independent voltage source with a short circuit now let's say the current that will be flowing through this r1 is equal to i1 double prime and the voltage that will be dropped across this r1 is vr1 double prime vr1 double prime is the drop across this r1 due to this ia source and i1 double prime is the current flow through this r1 for this is current source superposition theorem states that our total voltage across our r1 resistor vr1 will be the algebraic sum of the voltages that means i will add the vr1 prime and vr1 double prime or the current through this r1 will be the algebraic sum of the currents i1 will be equal to i1 prime plus i1 double prime the condition is that the direction of i1 prime and i1 double prime must be in the same direction if they are flowing in opposite direction i will replace this plus sign with a minus sign the condition of vr1 prime plus vr1 double prime is that they have to share the same polarity that means both in both case they have to share the plus minus at this terminal and this terminal if they share opposite polarity then i will subtract vr1 double prime from this vr1 prime for opposite polarity this is the statement of superposition theorem